How to repurpose long form videos into shorts. Hey guys, this is Shine, and in this tutorial, I am going to show you how you can repurpose your contents, be it in any format, like a wide format, into vertical format like stories or YouTube shorts, all using Filmora 14. Now, if that sounds interesting, then stay on with me because this is going to be a step by step tutorial where I'll show you everything in a step by step manner. So, that being said, let's jump over to our laptop and let's start. So, in here, as you can see, I've got my Filmora open. So, the first First thing that you want to do is over here select the aspect ratio right as 9 is to 16 because we are going to do vertical videos once it's done i'll click on short video project now as soon as we go for short video project you can see the player comes up on the right hand side so i need to adjust my webcam a little over here so that you can see every part of it so i hope this is visible now right so what we all need to do over here is import the video that we want to repurpose so in here i have a video which is in wide format right so let me play this video a little so that you can understand so as you can see, this is a full blown podcast between these two artists, right? You can see over here. Now, what I want is that I want a shot in where when this guy speaks, it will be this guy on the frame. And when this lady speaks, it will be this lady on the frame, right? It would be like camera doing pan, right? So that is the whole purpose of this video. So let's go ahead and actually check out whether we can do it with Filmora or not. So for that, we are going to import this first of all. And once imported, you can see it appears like this. We are going to hit this plus icon to add this to our timeline. While doing that, make sure that you keep project settings because on the project, you have decided it to be a vertical video. But by default, the media is a horizontal one, right? So if you click on this, then the project settings would be changed. So you want it in a vertical project like this. Click on this. And as soon as you do so, you can see it has been converted into a this kind of thing but this is not the ideal way the shot should appear because on top there is nothing on bottom there is nothing and this appears to be a compressed form so this is very easy to do but i don't want to do it in this way i want a full screen thing right so for that first of all we are going to actually make it full screen just like this by adjusting right so you can see it has been done now let's drag this to make it in position just like this as you can see the position has been done right so this is the position where the male uh, speaker is so let's actually go ahead and listen to this and i'll show you how we are going to make the changes so let's play this welcome back everyone we're talking about the uh, new ai features in filmora 14 today such an exciting upgrade for content creators yep absolutely so you can see over here the lady takes over right so now we want our camera to focus the lady so for that what we'll do is that we'll come over to this point and in here we'll select the video click on this thing and in here we are going to find something called keyframing right so first add a keyframe now on this keyframe don't make any changes because this keyframe has been just allocated as a placeholder which will keep the values constant right so that the things done don't change over here so that's why i added this keyframe now i'm going to add another keyframe frame where we are going to make the change so for that i've just moved the cursor a little bit and now let's go ahead and add another keyframe and once i've done that you can see the second keyframe is selected now what we are going to do is that we are going to change the position by dragging just like this right so now you can see the lady is in focus so now if we play this there would be the change so let's take uh, a look at new this. ai features in filmora 14 today such an exciting upgrade for content creators yep Absolutely, these updates are like that, right? Different. So that's how cool it is. You don't need to crop. You don't need to have uh, multiple editing going on. Nothing. It's simple keyframe and position adjustments that you can do. Now that being said, there would be also another time when this girl stops speaking and the person over there, that is the male counterpart, will start speaking, right? So sure. You so, can see this is the point we have identified, right? So in here again, we are going to go over here and then add two keyframes as we did in the previous occasion. So remember this thing, two keyframes are very much required. And on the second keyframe, we will actually go ahead and change the positions just like this. And boom, we are done, right? So now if we play this again, you'd see there is a shift in the, the camera. Feature. Sure. So you can see that, right? video is um, a super nifty tool where you just type in your idea or a script and Filmora uh, automatically generates a video timeline. It's like um, mm -hmm. magic, but for your video workflow. That's insane. Again, okay, you can see the girl has started talking, but remember, for the girl, we have these two keyframes. So just select this using control and then right click and go for copy keyframe, right? Just copy this. Then take your cursor to the point where you want to paste it right here and right click and go over to keyframe and then click on paste keyframe. Or you can simply do control V, con control C, control V as well. That also works. So that being said, now let's play and see whether this works or not. That's insane. Imagine. 
So you can see it. now it has become very easy. So for the male counterpart, we just need to copy these two keyframes, and for the female, we just need to co copy these two keyframes, and boom, you can paste it at the position, and you are done. So in this way, you can actually repurpose any videos that you have into any format that you want to. So that's the power of Filmora 14, and I really hope that you guys have enjoyed it. Now there is also another way to do it, which is called cropping of the video. So for that, what we can do is that we can just come over here, select the video. And then we need to come over here. This is the crop tool. Just click on crop. And in here, we can crop it as well. We can select the ratio. So 9 is to 16. Now you can see the cropping frame. And in this way, we can adjust the frames as well. We can have this uh, cropped, right? And again, for this uh, girl, we can have this cropped as well. So this way also we can do it. But this is more a time-taking process. The keyframing is more easier process, right? So that being said, I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this tutorial. And uh, we will meet again on some other tutorial. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.